production like that, I almost want to cry. And remember, this is a comedy show, not a. <laughs> Anyways, my name's Colleen. This is my service dog, Copper. Copper's a fully trained service dog. There's only two tasks that I haven't been able to get him to do. Kind of like the men in my life, I can't get him to do the dishes, and he can't keep his nose out of other women's crotches. <laughs> <laughs> She came to be as a result of an accidental breeding, kind of like my kids. <laughs> I have four kids. I have two girls and two boys. I finally figured out what causes it, though. Yeah, I totally stopped drinking water. <laughs> Incidentally, I also stopped having sex. So. <laughs> yeah. I've learned a lot about myself since I've started, since I became a parent. Though the other day I was looking in the mirror and I, I was like, wow, I've changed so much, right? Like my face. I have one of those faces that looks like I've just killed my entire family. I gotta admit, that has actually gone through my head on a daily basis for the last 20 years. <laughs> the only big difference between Copper and my kids is uh, Copper's actually capable of learning. <laughs> I can say that, and, and, and please, I know I'm not getting any Mother of the Year award, but I should mention my kids are actually up here in the front, so Hi. they do kind of look <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So my, um, I wanted to give you an example of just how crazy my kids are and, and why that statement rings true for me. So I'm gonna tell you a little bit of a story. Um, my eldest son, <clears throat> not mentioning any names, Alex. Uh, <laughs> one day I get a call from the tenant. We lived upstairs, and there's a tenant downstairs, and the tenant phones me up, and she says. Oh my god, Colleen, I think one of your kids just fell off the roof. So we're running downstairs, and oh my god, what's going on? And, and Alex's younger brother is standing there, and he's kind of chuckling away. And I'm like, what happened? He goes, dumbass fell off the roof, you jumped off. <laughs> I'm like, what? what are you doing? What were you thinking, Alex? Like, why would you do that? He goes, Mom, I forgot to put my cape on. <laughs> 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 uh, the boys, well, I'll let their wives deal with that. Sorry. <laughs> but, you know, getting back to it, you know, I've learned a lot about myself. Um, one thing I've learned a lot about myself is that I hate making decisions. I'm just, I'm almost incapable of it now. I went to Walmart the other day, and uh, I was hungry, so I stopped at Subway to grab something to eat. And, you know, I couldn't believe how many choices there are. You have to go through the bread, and then you have to go through the veggies and the cheese. By the time we got to, like, the condiments, um, I just looked at the kid. He's like, well, what do you want on it? And I'm like, fuck, man. I haven't even decided if I want to keep my kids yet. Like, <laughs> I don't know, you know. Pretty bad. <laughs> um, speaking of Walmart, you know, one of the, my biggest pet peeves about going to Walmart with Copper is I keep getting people running up to me and wanting to pet my dog. I don't mind, like I know people like dogs, they want to pet the dog, but it pisses me off when they come up and they just randomly start petting him. And then they tell me their life story about how they had a childhood dog and they had kids, their dogs growing up. I get it, everybody loves dogs. You know what? I love dick too. <laughs> I don't go through Walmart and walk up to a stranger and be like, oh my God, you have a dick? Holy crap. 